Today we're going to be testing out our new fish scale by Roe Deer. This scale has been sent to me free of charge for this review and we are going to try a little bit of fishing today. Try to catch a fish to show you what the scale looks like while it is weighing a fish. However, before we do that, I do want to show you some of the different features that this scale offers. So first of all, this scale can be powered one of two ways. It does have a built-in lithium battery, which is rechargeable by a micro USB cable, which they do include for you. It's going to take about three to four hours to get a full charge, and then you're going to get 50 hours of continuous runtime from the charger. And right here on the bottom of the scale is where you're going to plug that charger in. If you don't want to charge it, you do have a spot for batteries right on the back here. And that's gonna be three AAA batteries. As you can see here, those are not included. On the front here is where your waterproof control panel is going to be. So on and off here, it's just going to be a quick press. And then your LED display screen is going to pop up. Over here, we have a tear button, which is going to zero the weight if you need to do that. And then we also have this unit button so you can pick your unit of measurement that you want. So we have have pounds, gin, ounces, and then it's going to tell you the temperature outside. Then you do also have kilograms. Then down here in the bottom left hand corner, you do have your battery indicators. On top here, we do have a ergonomic handle that slides out, comfortable to hold on to while you are weighing your fish or weighing your luggage, whatever the case may be. Like I said, it is very comfortable to hold on to. The maximum weight capacity of this scale is 110 pounds, so you are going to be able to weigh a variety of different things with this scale. If you do have something that is over the max weight limit, it will automatically go into a screen so you know that the max weight has been reached. And then right here on the side, which I really like, is a tape measure. So if you are fishing, of course, wherever you're at, there are different fish regulations on what you can keep depending on the size. So it is really nice that they have provided this tape measure for you. With this tape measure, it does go up to 59 inches, so you are going to be able to measure a variety of different things as well. So with all that being said, we're gonna do some fishing, try to catch a fish so I can show you what it looks like while you are weighing it with the fish scale. All right, so lucky enough, we did get us a fish here, and just by feeling it by hand without using the scale yet, I would say it's probably half a pound, but we'll see what the scale has to say. All right, so I was a little bit off. This fish is just about a pound. So that is what the scale is going to look like, of course, when you are weighing a fish or whatever you may be weighing. Like I said, this is a very versatile scale, so it doesn't have to be used just for fish. If you have a garden that you are wanting to weigh your produce or if you are weighing luggage, you can very easily use this scale for that as well. With the scale, they have also provided this webbed hook here. The way you're going to use this is to just fold it over, hook it onto this little triangle piece, and then you would just simply put it on the hook and whatever you are weighing is, is of course going to be wrapped around this so you can very easily pick it up, whether that be luggage or a fruit basket, vegetable basket, whatever the case may be. So that is the roe deer fishing scale. It's gonna be used for a variety of different things, whatever you need to weigh. And it is a scale that I would recommend. It's accurate, easy to use, and it is a scale that you should have in your fishing kit.